Women's Minister of State for Labor and Employment, Nkeiru Kaunye Jocha, has challenged members of the National Union of Road Transport Workers to contribute to the peace and harmony of the nation. She spoke while receiving newly elected leadership of the union in Abuja. TVC News Jokea Desai reports. For the better part of 2023, the NURTW, one of Nigeria's leading transport unions, was emerged in crisis following fractionalization of its leadership. Its headquarters was subsequently taken over by men of the Nigeria Police Force to avoid further breakdown of law and order. In October, the union at its 10th quadrennial National Delegates Conference elected a new set of leaders. But the crisis in the southwest region, where the office of the national president is zoned yet to be resolved, the union has an acting president. The new leadership is at the Ministry of Labor and Employment to officially intimate the minister of an end to the crisis in the union. We believe that the external interference by some players and sometimes outright ban of our activity by some state government, especially by way of purported prosecution in contrary to the spirit and the letter of domestic and international legislation. The host is happy and end has come to the troubles of the National Union of Road Transport Workers. Thank you for supporting the President, Senator Ahmed Bola Tinibu. He's committed to the peace of the country. She urged NURTW and sister unions to always prioritize the nation's peace in the discharge of their daily activities. NURTW is not outside the vehicle that the president is part of. If there are anything that is left undone as we speak, that with your kind cooperation, that it will be done. Each and everyone should be ready give his modest contribution towards national development. Your role as uh, leaders of the union is to ensure that there is peace, but also render an effective service delivery to Nigeria. While an aggrieved faction of the union is still in court, the new leadership insists rule of law and due diligence were strictly adhered to in the election that brought it into office. It appeals to any warring member to sheet swords and embrace its lofty ideas for a new and improved National Union of Road and Transport Workers. Jokeyatsa, TVC News, Abuja.